Hey dads, welcome to Cooking with Cameron. Coming to you on the Fathering channel. Time to open up, time to get in the kitchen and try to work out how a potato and a skewer becomes an accordion. Let's go check it out. G'day dads, great that you could join us again tonight. Now, cooking up some lamb chops and cutlets and just some off-cutty sort of pieces for dinner tonight. So they're just getting barbecued up. What are we gonna do though with the potatoes? Well, seen on Facebook a few times now, potatoes, and they're called accordion potatoes. And it's basically where we just get the spuds, we cut them up, reasonably thick slices, and then using a skewer, skewers to help, we cut a, a crisp cross pattern in it, and then you can string them apart. And then we can either deep fry them or cook them in the oven. I'm gonna cook them in the oven because I just couldn't bother deep frying tonight. So, one other trick I've learned in looking at this, I'm gonna cut my potatoes and then I'm gonna put them in just cold water for a half hour, maybe an hour, see how much time we've got before the family are home. And uh, that's gonna take some of the starch out of the potatoes. So then once we go to cook them, that's actually gonna help them be a bit, once they're drained off, cook them, they're gonna come up a little bit crisper. So let's get into cutting these up. So, just gonna cut, snap that in half now. Now I've just cut that potato, I don't know, a bit over five mil, probably getting up to eight mil thick. I'll cut these ones up in a moment. And then we're gonna put the skewers either side. So I've cut one side. Now I turn it over, and I'm actually gonna cut on the diagonals. And now if all things come together, we can twist it like an accordion. I reckon I might cut them a little bit closer together than what they are there. But you get the general idea, hey Dad? Should be fun. Let's get into it. Right here, dads. As you can see, when they pull apart, they twist. I did try to do one straight cross hatch, doesn't twist. So you gotta make sure you turn them on the 45. And the thinner, the closer the slices to get, the more she's gonna twist a bit about. So I'm gonna let that sit in that water. I've probably got half an hour before I get to put them in the oven. Anyway, dads, I'll come back to you when we're ready. Rightio dads, been about half hour, so I'm just gonna drain these out. Actually, I'll just shake them off, why not? Give them a shake off. So what we gotta do now, Mm. 
I love how it looks easy on Facebook. We've sort of got the idea, don't we, Dad? Anyway, I'm gonna keep going. Hopefully they get better as I go along. Well, Dad's <coughs> I don't know how well it's going to work, but it looks a little bit fancy, doesn't it? I guess that's what matters. So I've got these just on the tray here. Now my idea of cutting the, them in half was great, but there's no sharp edge on that, so find something to do with those. Now, in here I've just melted some garlic, some butter and uh, some rose root milk. Give these a good basting. Now to bung them into the oven. Probably they're probably going to take about 30, 35 minutes. Set at 180 degrees, and uh, while they're cooking. We'll start uh, getting closer to the 45 minute time. Yeah, if they're gonna take about 45 minutes, we'll get the barbecue fired up so everything comes off at the same time. Anyway, dads, let's get these into the oven. Oh, that was pretty good, actually. Well, dads, how good do they look? They've come up a treat. Don't think they've come up as accordion as they said on Facebook, but you know, Look, it's a bit of fun, isn't it? That's what cooking's about, getting into the kitchen, having a crack, and seeing what you can come up with. So it must be about time to serve up. But hey, hang Cameron. on. Yeah, yes, darling. Something's just arrived for you. I've got cake. You we, do. We've got dessert. Yeah, the fathering project sent a cake for you because it's been two years that you've been doing uh, these cooking segments. Shows. For them and they said thank you well thanks guys well you know it's all about you guys too because you guys have all been part of it hey guys yep that's right two years since we've been doing the fathering channel and the cooking show it's been a pleasure to keep cooking for you i hope you're having fun because that's what it's about isn't it kids and mum yeah. yep. anyway dads i'm gonna put this aside great to be keep cooking well there's more coming don't worry <coughs> can i leave that with you darling sure and we will have some dessert Anyway, dads, time to serve up. We've got our onion, we've got some barbecued mushroom, got some veggies. When I boil my veggies, all I want them to do, once that water's reboiled, that's it, they're cooked. So, time to plate up. Anyway, dads, over to you guys. Have get into the kitchen, have some fun. Now, as I said, we've been having fun for the last two years look forward to having more fun with you over the next few years. Anyway dads, till next time, according to the potatoes, keep being great dads.